kiss to the Catwoman and Night of the Hunters. Look, man, I could be a goddamn Batman villain. Look at this crusty old thing. So, uh, one, this show is very, you know, I think depending on who you are, depending on what type of episodes you're going to like. Some episodes, I'm like, eh, some episodes I think are great. So, first episode of the show with the Penguin, uh, didn't care for a second episode I thought was great with Basil Carlo. Uh, Night of the Catwoman, or Kiss of the Catwoman. It's pretty entertaining. I like the Selena Cow. I like that they didn't try to make her, they didn't try to redeem her in any way. They didn't try to make her heroic. They had an old school classic black haired Lois Lane looking woman in purple and she was stealing because uh, she ran out of daddy's money and she was not heroic in any way. And I'm like, it's fun. She's this annoying Batman. At one point he said, rid Gotham of her nonsense. And I thought that was really funny. So uh, yeah, I like that. I like this Catwoman. Uh, we don't need her to be here all the time. We don't need her to have some redemptive thing. That's one thing uh, in the Batman. I like Catwoman. I like their portrayal of Catwoman, but I kind of wish she was a little more on the villainous side, that's why I like the Dark Knight, uh, Dark Knight Rises Catwoman a little bit more. She seems a little bit more villainous, even though you understand that she's doing it for poverty reasons. A little bit more of that villainous side of her. Uh, Night of the Hunters, I thought was creative. I was like, this show's getting intelligent. I like the idea that the, the cops are setting up, you know, fake robberies, uh, fake, you know, harassing people in alleyways just to lure Batman out. I think that's creative. They're trying to get Batman. I like that he's fighting cops in the show. I think that's cool. I never liked Batman being on the side of cops. I understand that he is. You know, when you watch Batman, Batman standing sad, you know, side by side with cops. But I never liked him being on the side of cops. I like him running from cops and fighting cops. That's that's my Batman. He's anti-authoritarian. I don't like him standing next to the authority. You know, be against the cops, not with the cops. So, yeah, I understand he's with Gordon. But that's like the one cop. I do like uh, they're setting up Barbara's disdain for the police in this. So you can see the, the little trail they're leaving for her to become Batwoman one day. Kind of similar trail that they had with uh, Robin in Dark Knight Rises. Whatever the hell his name was. Joseph Gordon Levitz. So, so far, still going strong. Uh, damn good show. Don't love it like a 5 out of 5, but it's, it's a solid 4 out of 5 so far. And uh, yeah, I'm going to finish it today.